On 9-11, I was not very far away. Um, I have my home on 42nd Street. And when I looked out the window, I could see um, where the first plane hit. And a very dear friend of mine, photojournalist Bill Biggert, he ran to the buildings where he was on 12th Street, and he ran to see if he could help. And um, he had been in too many wars as a photojournalist. But this one, he did not survive. When he got to the towers, he was, he was speaking with his wife. He said he was going to leave. And we have recovered three months later. The last photograph he took, he, was, he raised himself up, and the building is falling on him. And they recovered his photograph for three months later in the cameras. The Table of Silence is a choreography where I bring over 160 dancers onto Lincoln Center to create a peace labyrinth. I thought by bringing up the energy of the peace labyrinth, which is a mandala energy for peace and harmony in the world, that we could send this message through the human body, the instrument through which we live our lives and through which we dance. We could make that expression reach beyond words, yes. And so um, we've been doing this now for several years, where we come to Lincoln Center and we recreate the Peace Labyrinth. And we send the message out to the world, awakening our humanity through art, through the art of the body through which we speak, the human body. Because human existence is a miracle, and therefore you are a miracle. And we should all celebrate our humanity. And the existence of humanity should continue many, many, many more years. You know, this is our hope. Every, every nation, there is only one race, the human race. And we all come together and we send our message um, for peace.